We are being pushed to the wall. Igbo elders react as court denies Mazin Namdekanu's Bay application. Says President Muhammad Buhari have no respect for Igbo elders. Well, this court judgment today did not come as a shocking. <laughs> it did not come as a surprise. So I believe, I don't know why Igbo elders have not actually understand what is playing out here. That the government right now is not ready to release Mazin Namdekanu. He have told them before now that let the court determine Mazin Namdekanu's fate. So they should see that President Mohamed Buhari is not ready to release Mazin Namdekanu, not even now. They have been saying it and all that. And what they are just doing is just to buy time for themselves. They are going to leave this matter for another president. <laughs> You will see it. Mazin Namdekano is not going to be released soon. They know that they have no case against him. So to stand with Mazin Namdekano to judge issue, we bring more problem. They go hook. So now you make them, they do all these things. Recall that the other day, President Mamadou Buhari also told uh, the Prime Minister of the United, United Kingdom, Boris Johnson, that... Uh, the uh, federal government will not grant the IPOB leader bill. When he was asked, why is it that the IPOB leader, Mazin Namdekano, is still in the detention of uh, DSS? He answered, he said, Mazin Namdekano cannot be granted bill because he said so many all, com all, all complimentary ways against the Nigerian government. So just like that, just like that but we have people who are in our backyard killing people who have displaced millions of nigerians from their ancestral homes who have killed thousands of nigerians who have made lives horrible for us today the nigerian government do not see those people as a threat to this government but they see agitators as a problem to them. Well, I've been saying this before, that even what is happening in the Southeast is being state managed. Yes, because they don't have plans to release Mazin Namdekano. And they want every other person to see Mazin Namdekano as the, you know, the bad egg thing. So, it should not be a shock to Igbo elders. It's not today started it. You people went to him, you know, and all that. After giving you hope, he turned around again. So you just have to just wait and see how it goes. And uh, the president is not the court. He's not the one that determines whether Mazen and the Kanu will be released or not. Understand? According to him, he said the court will determine Mazen and the Kanu's fate. So it should allow the court to do its job. It should not speak for the courts. So if court, if Mazen Namdekano committed crime against the Nigerian government, let the court uh, determine that, not the president. You understand? You don't carry work give the president uh, the court. You went talk say you no want interfere. Now you still they put mad for court matter. The thing is just is, is 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 strange. You said you cannot interfere in any judiciary, whatever. And the same you, you are still saying that the the uh, courts cannot grant Mazen and the Canoes bill. So what they are trying to tell us now is that Buhari is the court. Finish. And you said you cannot you cannot interfere. Record that Justice Ben Tanyako of the Federal High Court sitting in Abuja. Again, denied bail application of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipo Mazi Namdekano. Politics Nigeria report that ruling on the bail application, Justice Inyako said, for four years, nothing was filed in a court explaining why Mazi Namdekano left Nigeria. However, she said, she is open to considering a new application for bail and she granted a stay of the criminal uh, proceedings 
Furthermore, Justice Enyako advised Kano's legal team to approach the Court of Appeal on the issue of bail. Last month, the judge also denied Kano's bail application. She said at the time that the issue of Kano's absence in the past since 2017 should be determined before his bail application will be entertained. She ordered that Kano breach his former bail conditions and until that is head, his present bail application is immature. Since his rearrest in Kenya in June 2021, the separatist leader has been in the custody of the Department of State Services, DSS in Abuja. It's really strange that court is uh, uh, saying that Nandekano jump bail. I don't know why they are always saying that. And the, 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 the court is not aware why Mazen Nandekano jump bail. And I believe that they are aware that Mazen Nandekano escaped from his life, that the Nigerian government invaded his house. They are not even talking about that. And the same this issue of invention, the Umaya High Court have ruled against Nigerian government. They even find the government for invading Mazen and the Kano. Not be the same matter be this one. So what they are just doing is trying to buy uh, time for themselves. And uh, they just want Mazen and the Kano, you know, to suffer. Because they don't like all those things he said against President Muhammad Buhari and Nigerian government, you know, abroad while he was in UK. So that is it. And they should not try to make it personal. You understand? They shouldn't try to make it personal. So guys, what's your take on this? Igbo leaders react as court denies Mazen Namdekanu's bill, say they have been pushed to the war that the president of Nigeria have no respect for others. Let's hear from you. Thank you very much.